The last example that I have here is, let's put again some of this and let's test the translation command. So we are gonna be doing the same. We are gonna get the input column that is the feedback from the client, the sentiment column, and we are gonna create another column as an output that is gonna be the translation. And you can check here that you can define Mm -hmm. that you are translating, in this case, to Spanish, the feedback from the client. When I run this command, what it's going to be doing is getting all that column of sentiment with the feedback and it's going to translate all the feedback from the customer survey from that client line by line and translate from English to Spanish. And let's see how good it go in terms of the translation of this column. So pretty much it's really interesting what you can do with all these AI functions.